President Trump is considering a redo on his controversial immigration order after a federal appeals court upheld a stay of the travel ban on Thursday. He told reporters Friday he's working on a revised order and could unveil it next week. But the White House says all options are on the table and they may still pursue an appeal. For more on the White House's legal options, I'm joined by Paula Reed in Washington. So Paula, after the federal appeals court refused to reinstate this travel ban, President Trump tweeted, see you in court. But he hasn't yet appealed the case to the Supreme Court. So what are your sources telling you? That's right. In that tweet, he didn't specify which court and the fact that they haven't already appealed this temporary restraining order to the Supreme Court signals to us that that is not his first choice. We are told that they are weighing several options, including writing a new executive order. And through a new executive order, they could add more stringent vetting procedures without making it a blanket ban. It's also important to note that now the president has a confirmed attorney general, Jeff Sessions. He did not have that when he actually wrote and issued this executive order. Sessions has been briefed on all of the litigation surrounding this so-called travel ban. and He's the one who's overseeing its defense. So, Paula, if the president did put out a revised immigration order, would that help him in the long run? Legally, yes. We've already gotten signals from several of the federal judges who have reviewed this that there could be problems with ultimately this being upheld on the merits. For example, the district court judge who heard this case, he signaled to the Department of Justice that they're going to have a lot of problems because there weren't enough exceptions in this executive order. For example, there were no exceptions for people who had green cards. There were not exceptions for people who had their visas because they had helped the U.S. or helped the U.S. military and helped enhance our national security. So the judge said that that, taken in the full context with the statements that the president made on the campaign trail, may make it difficult for the Department of Justice to prevail on the argument that this was just about national security and is not, in fact, a Muslim ban. Okay, I'm still trying to get my head around this twist on Friday that the Ninth Circuit Court of Appeals said that it may review the decision made by the three judges that heard the case. So is the court essentially arguing with itself and how does this impact the case? That's exactly what's happening. Uh, this is sort of arcane civil, pr civil procedure, but here's what happened. Three judges on the Ninth Circuit reviewed this decision and they decided to uphold this temporary pause on the policy while the courts debate its, its legality. But as sometimes happens, when an appellate court makes a decision, there can be a request for a larger group of judges to review that decision. The fancy word for it is en banc. And that's what happened here. But Rena, the court tells me that there are about 1,500 requests filed each year for a hearing on Bonk, and only 50 are actually heard. So it seems unlikely that this decision is going to get another look by a larger panel of 11 judges. And what's the status, Paul, of the original travel ban at this point? I know it's hard to keep track. There's every day it's something new. But as of right now, the president's executive order, it is as if it was never signed. But that's only temporary because now the courts are going to examine this policy and determine whether or not it is in fact constitutional for the president to enact a temporary ban on refugees and immigrants from seven predominantly Muslim countries. So it's just a temporary hold while the courts take a closer look at whether or not the policy is legal. Okay, this segment brought to you by the words on bonk. <laughs> Teaching us something new every time. Paula Reed, thank you for explaining it all.